Today's morning coffee vinyl side. Gus Babona and his orchestra. Babona deals in millions, 1961. This German pressing of Gus Babona's 1961 homage to the hits of the big band era was a nostalgia play that was surprisingly effective in channeling the spirit of that age into the 60s while not getting too caught up in the maudlin sentiments that can accompany looks backwards. Gus was a reed player, whose main instruments were clarinet and saxophone, and he made his bones as a young player during the height of the big band and swing era, playing alongside many of the greats and many of the great bands. In this way, his look backwards is less about looking backwards and more about busting out some of what he carried forward with him. And he packed well. These recordings really swing, with a touch of modernity sprinkled in the mix and feature Babona as a soloist on clarinet and alto sax, along with others, including Morning Coffee Vinyl Side alum Jack Sperling on drums. Babona started fronting his own bands in the early 40s while still playing as a sideman in the remaining big bands and working himself towards an eventual gig with MGM Studios where he became a successful session player and band leader for many years. At some point he also partnered with legendary television hosts and songwriter and pianist Steve Allen for gigs and albums that suggest that the 50s were not so square and staid as you might think. Allen, like Johnny Carson who followed him, was a very accomplished musician, something of a renaissance man of his time, and his gigs with Babona speak to a level of sophistication that I need to explore more to better understand, as I don't have a good grasp of it. In my own life, I'm caught in a bit of a self-reflective haze as I await some medical appointments, tests, and follow-ups now that I have cancer attached to my diagnosis. With my thyroid out, it may all be academic, but it may also be the beginning of some more unpleasantness or a new course of treatment. I just don't know yet. But the coffee was really nice today. A wonderful little Guatemalan from the Weiwei Tanago region, from the Etiel Vasquez family farm. I made it in a hario pour over, and it was lovely. <laughs>